morning people well good morning good night good day it is a beautiful day it is a special day it's my birthday please don't ask me what I have planned for today because I had so many plans and everything just went out the window um, right now in Nigeria we are having a protest to end SARS. SARS is a subsection in the police force and they've been doing absolutely rubbish all these years, killing people, robbing them, kidnapping and all of that. And we're tired. As a country, we're tired. So there have been protests for the past eight days. Right now, the protest is outside my house. I can't even step out to buy anything. It is that bad and it has been going on for days. I doubt if I'm going to get my cake today because I ordered cake and I don't know if it's going to be able to get here because they blocked all the roads. A lot of places in Lagos, they blocked it. So basically, I have no plans today. No plans, but I'm grateful that I'm alive. Some people are not that lucky. Some people were going out and they were stopped by SARS and killed for no reason. What I guess I will do today is take my bath, do makeup, eat whatever is in the house, and just watch TV. <laughs> I think that's what I'm going to do today and that's why I'm taking so much joy in picking out what the kids are going to wear. Not like they're going anywhere, but I just enjoy the process. I got this hair accessory for Tiara like during her birthday, but she didn't really wear it. So let's see if we can bring it back today. Looks really cute though. What do you guys think? And then this is the t-shirt I want her to wear today. It says sparkle and with a pair of leggings. So in one of my favorite colors, pink and yellow. This is what Tito will be wearing. It's a pink shirt. I think it is so, so cute. I got all of this from Primark, by the way. And I did a Primark haul video on my second channel. So check that out. Um, and it's so cute. Tito doesn't like pink, but hope he wears this one today just for me. At least it says Jude. <laughs> doesn't look masculine or feminine. Please, I beg anybody can wear pink. Men can wear pink. Women can wear pink. So this is what I want him to wear today. I actually have not filmed in a long time. I've not vlogged in a long time. And I feel I can see a difference in my face. I feel like I have lost weight. And I'm happy about it. I wanted to lose weight like just in time for my birthday so I can fit into some clothes. But the dress I thought I was going to wear, mm, there's no need to wear it now. But I bought a new dress. <laughs> I bought a different dress, so maybe I should just take my bath, do my makeup, and um, get dressed to go nowhere. Um, I washed my hair yesterday. I took out my braids two days ago, washed my hair yesterday. This lovely lady, precious, she came all the way to the house. She did house service for me, home service, and it was so stressful for her to get to me and to even get back home because of this protest. She left my house, let's say, by 2 o'clock. By 11 p.m., she has not reached her house. So um, I'm thankful, precious, for taking time out to come and help me wash, treat my hair. So I'm going to style it by myself this morning, maybe just in a bun, and then get on with the rest of the day. Why is today special? Because it's your birthday. Yes, it's my birthday. It is my birthday today. So what are you doing for me? Under pressure. I'm putting you under pressure. What are you doing for me today? Daddy said we will, we will get all of the birthdays, your birthday cake and birthday stuff tomorrow. Oh, maybe because of the protest. Well, I hope that's going to be possible. Yeah. Tito, at five years old, is still such a big fan of Thomas. We have to do something about this. Why do you like Thomas so much? And I'm, and I'm a big fan of Sonic too. Yeah, okay, yeah, Tito likes Sonic. He likes Thomas and Sonic. Yeah, Sonic is the newest one. I wanted to tell you guys this morning that I looked at Tito this morning and he kind of reminded me of this guy, this MKHBD. I don't know if that's the right name. There's this tech guy on YouTube. Tito kind of reminded me of him this morning. Before Tito did his hair, Tito used to look like Chadwick Bosman with a particular hairstyle. And where we would go, people would be like, Tito looked like Chadwick Bosman. 
Tito keeps changing his face. And there was a time people used to say Tito looked like Davido. People thought he looked like Davido. So what do you guys think? From where I'm standing, that's what he looks like. I will put the link to the guy's channel so that you can check if truly there's a resemblance. Because these protesters are outside and we can't leave the house, it's difficult to buy food stuff unless we want to trek to the market. Like there's no transportation unless we want to trek to the market. The market is very far. There's no way I can trek to the market. I'm going to take like at least an hour to trek to the market. And then we didn't really have a lot of food stuff in the house. Like, thank God, a few days ago, I decided to buy a carton of noodles and a bag of rice and a pack of beans, just a small pack of beans. And that is basically what we have. And thank God, I actually bought palm oil and vegetable oil. I don't know, for some reason, I was buying those things and I was like, ah, MC, you can still do it next week. But I was just like, let me just buy it. And that's how I bought it. We don't have eggs. We don't have a lot of things and <laughs> we don't have especially meat or chicken and that is what is stressing me out this morning because um i actually paid for a caterer to bring food for me yesterday and the caterer could not get here because of the protest so me where i didn't say i go cross my leg this morning there's no crossing leg i have to look for food to cook there's no chicken there's no meat so I'm trying not to panic, but in my mind, I'm panicking. There's no soup in the house. And I don't know why the government cannot just end SARS, let everything just be calm. This is, I'm trying to just, you know, you're just trying to be like, you know what? Even if it's that we eat noodles today, maybe by tomorrow they would have stopped the protest. But Yomi went out now. He tried to go out. <laughs> I wouldn't say he went out. He tried to leave through the estate gate and he's like, the protesters, the crowd there is worse than yesterday. So that means no hope today. And I'm just like, <sighs> uh, just going through my Facebook um, messages. Your turn, your daddy was the first to wish me happy birthday on Facebook. Mommy. Tito gave me a card. Mommy. Mommy. He says to a very special mom with love, birthday wishes. You are wished a world of happiness in everything you do. And a day that brings special things. Okay. Is this Tito's handwriting? No. This daddy's handwriting. No. That's my handwriting. Happy birthday, mommy. From, okay, yeah, this is Tito's handwriting now. From Tito and Tiara. Tito, I like the way you write your name and Tiara's name. Yeah. So cute. Thank you. Oh, okay, this is from daddy. Yeah. With love to my wife. I'm surprised you could find it with love to my wife. <laughs> Okay, let's look inside. Wishing you lots of happy. Uh, uh, this one is a book, or oh. this one is not a card. Uh -huh. It has like so many pages. Yes, yeah, let's read that. I like to read. Let's read. <laughs> he says, this is, I like to read. Of your husband, Yummy, before you used to be a dreamer. Now you're not a dreamer again. Before, Yummy used to write from a dreamer to a dream. Now, now your eyes have opened. Just chilling, and the kids are just playing on the bed <laughs> and scattering everywhere. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day. I'm trying to make this darkness go away. I'll paint with colors. And I'll sing until my lungs give out mm -hmm. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day And I will leave my windows open So that I can hear the sound of people talking And the wind blowing in the trees Oh, I will open up my eyes so I can see the light Spread my wings so I can fly Oh, when the darkness starts to fade Feels like things are gonna go my way I'm gonna let the 
sunshine in the day I'm gonna let the past be filled with smoke And I will try to fix what has been broken Just finished having breakfast, what I had was coffee and slices of toast like it's so simple but it can be so so delicious and i use salted butter so it was so good so our tv it's not a smart tv but uh there's a way yomi connected the i think it's ps something the PS console shall connected it to the TV so from there we can watch YouTube, Netflix and all of that. So that's what made this our tiny TV become a smart TV. I'm looking for Yoruba movies that I can actually watch. I feel like when I want to relax, that's what I do. Look for Yoruba movies to watch and this one with Messi Aigbe, mm, should I? I like Mercy Aigwe, Odun Lade. Uh, I've watched this one. Okay. This Albarica, I was watching it yesterday. Let me finish it. If you're someone that likes Yoruba movies, go and watch this Aweja. Very interesting. Part one to three. It occupied me. And this is the Albarica part two. I don't watch part one, so I make I continue my part two and use that opportunity. To relax so I control the um, what's it called the YouTube or whatever it is we're doing with this game part so I think it's a PA something but it's a very old one Sha. but the truth is it is still working and that's how we're able to turn our ordinary TV into a smart TV this TV is very old it needs upgrading <laughs> but for now it kind of still works I'm gonna let the past be filled with smoke I will try to fix what has been broken and take this weight off my shoulders cause I know yesterday come I'm just taking my bath and it's time for me to do my makeup I've not done makeup in like weeks <laughs> maybe three weeks maybe two weeks I've not done makeup I hardly do makeup these days unless like I'm doing like a proper video which I have not done in a long time um, but I will start with skin. So lately, I've started taking care of my skin. And before, I just use Vaseline. Anything my hand touch, Tiara's cream, Tito's cream, I use it on my face. But I noticed I was having like breakouts. So I stopped at a store. Where did I stop at? Is it Essenza or one of these stores, Sha? And they recommended some products to me. I've been using this one for about three weeks now and I think I like it. I feel like I want to start taking care of my skin now that I'm getting older. And I know some of you are curious, Ziemi, how old are you? See, that is one of the most asked questions about CCME. Anytime I go on Google and I check, I'm always saying CCME's age. How old is CCME? CCME is what? guess just let me know in the comment section how old you think i am and how old you think i'm turning today but anyways this is the cream i'll be using for my face so this is like a moisturizing cream so this is supposed to be a multi-active day early wrinkle wrinkle correction do you like not even read it <laughs> i've been using it and i actually feel like i like it anyways let's moisturize i've heard that as you get older you should start tackling your skincare issues, especially in your 20s. And then in your 20s, in your 30s, so that you don't go to regret in your 40s. <laughs> so I want to really take care of my skin, not Vaseline anymore. I'm going to actively take care of my skin. I actually bought new makeup for the first time. I bought new foundation and I bought new powder so i got the estee lauder double wear foundation i got this because of patricia bright she made me do it i got the powder too so we're going to give this a try today so i'm trying to grow my brow and it's taking so long i use this concealer this concealer is what do they call it now everybody knows it la girl 
year I've not found a lot of reasons to wear makeup like I've not gone for a lot of events and I've not done the kind of videos where I feel like I like to do makeup I feel like when I'm using new products I get very excited to do my makeup now yeah problem deal I feel like I prefer this brow to this brow what's going on <laughs> what is going on ah oh. How do I get this brow to look like this? Do you think they look similar now? I think close. I still need to adjust something here. So we're using our new foundation. What color is this? 6C1. I just hope this is my color. They tested it on me the first time I tried it and it looked okay. So let's try it again. It does feel light. The day I tried it, the lady was like, she's trying to match it to my neck because um, she said my neck, my chest and my body looks lighter than my face and that for some reason my face is darker. And so the best thing is to match it to my neck. So let's see how that goes. And I noticed here my face got darker and I just left it like that, shower, hoping it will come back. But so far, it hasn't. It's drying out so quick. I think it's because the AC is on, like I'm directly under air condition. So I think that's why it's drying up quickly. But my, the foundation that I use typically is Mary Kay. All this while I've been using Mary Kay foundation. It doesn't dry this quickly. I don't forget the process of makeup. Let me put eyeshadow. This is the only eyeshadow I have been using. This is Jackie Aina's eyeshadow palette this is the lash i'm using i've used it so many times so let's see how it goes Is done let me get home with the rest of the makeup I doubt if they'll be able to deliver the cake tomorrow because the protest it never still stop and it looks like this week they really want to focus on the protest so who is going to bear the loss of this cake am I going to pay for cake that I did not receive but I mean what's the cost of cake to human lives that have been lost so far because of SARS and because of the bad see the bad governance in this country. I can't even explain. It affects so many things. I've not been able to create content for days now because it just didn't feel right to to create content with all that's been going on. But like just for self, what's the word? self-preservation and just so that somebody does not go into depression i'm back creating content because it is what i love i'm at home i can't just sit down at home and do nothing because it helps keep my mind occupied and it keeps me busy so that's it i just hope and pray the government listens to the citizens and just end SARS so that all of this can end. Kids can't go to school. I don't even think Tito will go to school this year because of all that is going on. I have this lip color from Kudi Cosmetics. I feel like I should try it. Until I do my hair before, I will know if I like this or not. <laughs> I don't know what my hair is saying, but this is how I have styled it for today. So this is what my hair and makeup looks like. Everything feels so dark. <laughs> this is this is not Cezanne's typical look. I'm wearing these earrings. I've had it for a long time now, and I'm wearing blue. I'm not like a blue wearing person, but that's what's happening. I feel like my makeup looks a bit edgy and it feels a bit dark but i am just reflecting the condition of nigeria that is the way everything looks like right now everything does not look rosy and pink 
so I don't know let me take some photos first if I don't like it I'll change outfit whoa look at Tito, Tito is this for me yeah. such a beautiful Thomas That's I love it you. oh thank you beautiful <laughs> Yes, Grandpa. Why is that you crying? Happy birthday! Are you yeah. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to my birthday. I want to go make dinner, so I have to take off these clothes because I don't want it to stay. So I just finished actually eating dinner, and it was nothing. It was nothing. <laughs> What's the word? It was nothing interesting, just rice stew and boiled egg. Today, a lot of prisoners escaped prison, like the door was open in Benin City and a lot of prisoners escaped. It feels like the people at the top are not listening and it's so annoying because they are supposed to be for us. So if you are not for us, you are against us and if you are against us, what are we doing? I feel like I'm tired of everything. I'm someone that I, what's the word? I'm looking for the right word. I, it's not internalized. I catch feelings. <laughs> That's the English I can use to explain it. I catch feelings easily. If I'm reading a book and the book is sad, I will be sad for like one week after reading it. If I'm watching the movie and the movie is happy or the vibe of the movie will affect me for a while and it will affect everybody around me. And not because they did anything, it's just the vibe I got from the movie. And I will start, if somebody was heartbroken in the movie, I will start be, uh, behaving like I'm heartbroken and all that. So I'm someone that I know that my emotions are very, I don't know, <laughs> are they contact emotions? <laughs> I'm just very angry. I'm really angry. And I'm angry because I feel helpless. And it's not just about me. It's about other Nigerians. I don't know what to do. And I hate, this is one of the feelings I hate. I hate feeling helpless. I hate not knowing what's going to happen. Like tomorrow morning, are we going to wake up in a war? What is going to happen? I told you guys yesterday that they were doing, um, what was it called? Protest outside my gate. And right now the protest has been hijacked by hoodlums. Now that we have hoodlums everywhere, are they going to come and attack everybody? How are we protecting ourselves? Okay, we can't go out and do anything. We can't go out and buy things. At least when it was COVID, you were like, at least what's come to us? If I go out, I catch a disease, come back. But this one, you don't even know, like this, your fellow human being might attack you. Something might happen. I may be scared. I'm worried. I'm grateful that I have family and friends. They called, prayed for me. And I'm grateful that I'm alive. It's just that I'm not happy. I don't feel good. So many people have died. If you see all the reports of all the injustices like you just see so much and you're like in this nigeria that all of us are inside all these kind of things they happen and there is no justice i hate injustice i hate when something is not fair when life is not fair and i know life is not fair all the time but i really really hate it and then i've been feeling ill for the past couple of days so i just got better like a day ago that's why it feels like you can hear like I have a cold. Anyways, this is how I feel today. Thank you guys for all your messages. I've seen all your messages on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, WhatsApp, YouTube. Thank you everybody. And God bless you. I hope I celebrate 
my next birthday in a better Nigeria, a Nigeria that is reformed, a Nigeria that is different from what it is right now because we are in this country. So I pray that next year it will be a much better birthday celebration and I will look back on this video with happiness that we change something. I'm just hoping that we do. Anyways, thank you for watching today's video. I'll see you in my next one. Bye. My birthday cake is here, you guys. So the guy had to leave very early today, well, post birthday. <laughs> so even if he didn't arrive here on my birthday, at least I got it the day after my birthday. <laughs> So this is the cake. It is from the Create Company and it is called a boo cake. <laughs> As per bouquet, like flowers. If you want to order a boo cake, this is their detail, their phone number, their Instagram, their email. It's very cute. I feel like it's the perfect gift if you want to give to someone. I bought it for myself because I really liked it. I saw their company during lockdown and I was like, I'm going to buy this cake for myself <laughs> for my birthday. after my birthday <laughs> um, I just woke up the time is well I woke up earlier to pick up my cake the time is um, it's like afternoon shy it's like 12 and there's really nothing to do the kids are bored even me I'm bored because all I do is go online and scroll on Twitter and get very angry and walked up <sighs> I'm tired <laughs> Anyways, um, Yomi is trying to pump the um, pool outside. We've not used it since lockdown, so he's trying to pump the pool so that the thing does not get spoiled and so that Tito and Tiara have something to do and then it takes up their whole day because once they don't play during the day, they don't sleep at night. That means me, I know they sleep, so I'm tired. Let them play and do something. So he's trying to pump that. When he pumps it, they will go out and play maybe i will join them i don't know and then we'll just make a day of it because life has been weird by the way the cake is outside so we're going to have to eat the cake as well if we don't want it to spoil i don't feel like eating the cake because it's too pretty but we have to eat this cake You want to go out through the window. You have to be patient. Be patient. Be patient. 
patience. Be patient. Sit it Just want your sunny days. Birthday cake. I feel bad eating it. So because these are cupcakes, which one do you want? Which cupcake do you want? This one or this one? This one. They put the cupcake in a cup. Alright. Yum. Oh yeah, take. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.